Hello guys, and welcome to Let's Stream Diablo 3. Oh Jesus Christ, that's loud. Let me change the audio settings a little. <laughs> Sorry about that. Thought I, I thought I was good at 50%, now let's put it to about 35. Alright, now I've never played this game before. I just finished installing it last night. I defragged it and everything this morning and logged in just to make sure it worked. Haven't made my first character yet. It's been my first experience playing it. Oh, hello! Chat's talking to me. I will be recording this whole thing and putting it up on YouTube after. Now, I did actually read through the character class stuff, but I haven't made a character yet. A cool thing I noticed that they did. Uh, it's not mana for every character as their, like, special resource. It's actually something different for everyone, so let me just give you a quick class rundown. Uh, Barbarian seems to be much like the Barbarian in the last one. He can be tank or DPS. Very physically powerful, tends to have really, really good armors and whatnot. Um, they use Fury instead of mana now. Demon Hunter seems to be kind of a cross between an assassin and a ranged Amazon. That's what it seems to be like, at least. Where the range, they use uh, tactics, no, discipline and hatred. So I'm not quite sure how that whole system works, but that seems cool. Some kind of double crossbow thing going on here. Uh, the Monk, which from what I've seen, I, I can't... It's not really like any of the other classes from what I've heard so far. Maybe a little bit of Assassin in Amazon? Not sure. Uh, they use Spirit. The Witch Doctor, which is definitely what I'm going to be playing, seems to be a lot like the Necromancer. Uh, they use Mana. And Wizard, which is another one I'm really interested in that I think I'll try some other time. Um, they use Arcane Power. I, the, the main reason I want to use the Wizard so much, actually, is um, because from what little I saw of the, of the demos and the betas and stuff, uh, the spells looked very Diablo. I'm not really happy with how these characters look so far. I think they don't look very Diablo. They look almost Korean MMO-ish, in that they're so glossy and have a lot of leg height, but I'll try and save my judgments for when I'm actually playing the game. So let's start here with the Witch Doctor, Medry Bread. Male Witch Doctor. Wow. That actually looks pretty awesome. Except for that knife is fucking huge. Um, auction House, Public Games. Profile? Oh, so this is just my personal profile, okay. Achievements, uh, game menu, and social. Oh, I got the Battle.net thing here, that's cool. Um, I might as well just start game, I guess. Hair difficulty modes are available in, in change quest menu, what? Oh, I've loaded fast. <laughs> ooh, ee, ooh, ah, uh, uh, fucking... I knew you're gonna do that. I wander to places beyond imaginings, far from the jungles of my youth. My knowledge has grown vast. The people, they think me banished, shunned to the end of my days. They say I defy the spirits, but I say no. I follow them. Ooh, Tristram. The spirits show me alone that the skyfire is I'm already liking where this is going. Begins. They say this must not be. I live to serve the spirits. So I go. There is none but me to answer the call. I get it, I get it. I like how they give you like, a little, little bit of background information. Just vague little stuff, just to tell you why you're there. The air is heavy with death. The fallen star... Oh my god. I love when you can hold click to go places. Now, I heard... I heard that you can actually walk over gold to pick it up. If so, that's awesome. Okay, so I got a blowgun here. I thought I had a knife. Simple knife. Oh, poison dart. That's a mana move I was using. Okay. Okay, okay. I gotta get used to this. I can use the number keys to... 
Well, this is weird. Can I put my health potions on the one button? Can I put it there? No? Okay. Learning the game, guys. Morning, fairy. Hold up, I'm closing it to Google Chrome. You should never close Google Chrome. Skills. Okay, primary is poison dart. So that's using mana, so I don't think I run out of those. If I hold shift, can I shoot it? Yes, I can. Okay, so controls are like the last one so far. What's that? Latency? Okay. Okay, my mana regenerates really fast. I think I should be using this poison dart then. Just a bunch of risen over here. I'm not sure I like how the risen look. They they don't look like the zombies in the last one. They don't look overly Diablo. Oh, quest giver. Hello, the cap. tell me go seek the cradle of the fallen star, and so I am here. It fell on the old cathedral. There was only one survivor, Leah. You should speak with her. Captain Rumford, more dead He's not weirded out at all by me. Whoa! What XP? Uh, there's the experience bar. I'm liking the interface. Hey, <laughs> crawling for so. I'm liking the interface. The interface is very World of Warcraft. I've never seen anyone fight like that before. Guards, <sighs> open the gates. You'll find Leah at the I, I wasn't fighting that impressively, dude, but okay. Okay, this is bothering me a little bit. Usually the right mouse button is your spell. And the leftmost button is your normal attack. Can I switch those around? How do I change those? Are the hotkeys all locked? Um, I'm sure the tutorial will tell me later on. Oh, I didn't even notice the map in the top right. Can I still use tab? Oh, that's annoying. I can't see dick when I do that. I liked the overlay map in the second game. Okay, so my stash is out here. If potions are gonna stack, then I might as well take them with me. Okay. More hotkey problems. Oh, you know I always have hotkey problems. Wow. What's with all the cowering people? You are Leah. The captain says you survived the fallen star. See, now the audio seems too low. But it blasted my uncle Deckard Kane into the depths Ooh. of the old cathedral. I Deckard Kane! But the dead were already rising. I came back here to rally the militia. But Watch out! The wounded are turning! Oh! So why did we put them in here? The spirits smile upon you. Yes! Eat dick. This is killing business. New skill. A secondary skill. Okay. I can learn Grasp of the Dead. Is that the only one I can learn, though? What's it do? Summons ghoulish hands from the ground that slow and entangle enemies. 50 mana. Okay. But is there anything else I can pick? I can buy primary, secondary. Well, I guess not. Okay. Oh, and it replaced my dagger. So can I change? Like, what if I want to use my dagger? I hope the game teaches me this shit. Alright, I'm going to turn up the volume because it seems too low to me. Open game to public. Uh, not yet. Gotta learn the game first. Skills are automatically added to your action bar. Pressing... oh. Well, I, I want to be able to add them myself. So it's an area of effect slowdown. Need more time. Okay. I like how I'm able to... Uh... Wow, I regenerate manifest. I like how I'm able to use these spells right in the middle of an inn. Usually when you're in town, it says not in town when you try to attack. Something is done. There is a deep sickness here, but it can be healed. Thank you. You should speak with Captain Rumford at the gate. He can tell you what to do. Okay. Okay, the audio still seems low. 
bump it up just a little. New Tristram. Huh. Okay, so I'm going east. I promised Marco I'd protect him, and now he's dead. I'm just yelling this out to myself. Sixteen militiamen went out. Only Rumford came back. How could that help us? We never should have built on this cursed ground. Maybe Cain was right. Even in death, Diablo torments us. Maybe it's because Deckard Cain's a man. And by a man, I mean the man. I'm not selling you my potions. Fuck you. Actually, how much money do I have? some interesting things on my latest. Almost none. You should take a look. I like how this is more, um, organized. I'll probably find better stuff. Are those leeches? I don't know what you're talking about. How can I help to fight the risen dead? I admire your courage, but Captain Dalton and the militia were slaughtered by those things. Only I survived. Their sacrifice saved their people. I will honor it. Well, I have seen you fight. Strike at the wretched mothers and their queen. They're the ones vomiting out these horrors. They're attacking the barricades! No, oh, that was convenient. I don't know if the game looks good so far. Oh, I can hold. That's nice. Saves my mouse. I don't know if the game looks good so far. We're still in the tutorial. Graphically, it... It looks of decent quality. There are more of them in the ruins down the road. Uh, yeah, it, it looks of good quality, like graphics-wise, but it doesn't look very Diablo. Yeah, this is the kind of witch doctor you can see saying, don't worry, be happy. All walking corpse? I don't know why only that one's called it. Okay, uh. Yeah, this one's not as good. New lore. I will never forget the first time I saw these horrors shambling out of the misty woods. Our loved ones, buried long ago, rose from their graves and began to attack the living. However, the risen dead were only the beginning. Okay, either they got the same voice actor who used to do Deckard Cain, or they got someone who does a really good Deckard Cain impression. Because that's phenomenal. Nothing? Okay. I don't know if I like the rag dolls when they die. I kind of miss them having death animations. Wow, that spell really slows them down. I can see that being useful. What is that? Well, I'm not sure what that was. I think it might have been health. I, Deckard Cain, have spent many years traveling and writing about the strange creatures in our world. But the sight of the wretched mothers still haunts me. They are the remnants of Queen Asilla's slaughtered handmaidens who were twisted by foul magic. Now they feast upon cadavers and regurgitate them as newly formed risen dead. That is still blowing me away. That really does sound like Deckard Cain. I really hope that is the same voice actor. I don't like that, you see? It's, it's not... It's not the same as checking bodies before. Bugs me. I think the game would look a lot nicer at 60 frames per second, but um, my the way I stream forces the frame rate to whatever I'm I'm uh, streaming at, and I stream at 6 or 30 frames. So, yeah. Did I just grow tattoos? I think so. Oh, here's one. 
Oh, she died fast. Um. Ooh. Better sword. Not that I really need it. I don't think I can use it. The game doesn't seem to be giving me any kind of option. Because I want to make my mouse buttons different moves, but... I don't seem to have a melee option anymore. They just kind of got rid of it. Weird. Maybe later I'll figure it some way. Damp cellar. Ooh, they kept the old sound effect for things flying through the Here's air. the powers that be. Griswold, bless his dear heart, risked everything to bring that dear boy home from the cathedral. Though he is troubled and moody now, I am certain it will pass, and he will once again be the sweet Wirt we all love. <laughs> I remember Wirt. He was such a fucking asshole kid. And you could, uh, you could rip off his peg leg in Diablo 2, uh, rip the peg leg off his corpse, and use it to make the Mad Cow World portal. That's not how you check a body. I need to flip it over. Oh, cool. Okay. New record massacre. Hardly. I only killed like 20 guys. That better not have been an achievement. Hold on, what's the achievement button? So I know there's one down here somewhere. Okay, good, that was not an achievement. Good. I hate when games give you achievements just for playing the game. Okay, so I put wristbands on my guy, on the model. Is that, that's all that was down here? Um, looks like it. Alright. Got some experience. Let's just kind of keep moving around. What's that? Pill fiend! Oh, they look different now. Sound the same, I think. Okay, if that's health I'm picking up, then that kind of bugs me. Seems too easy. In fact, this whole tutorial is really easy. It wasn't this easy in Diablo. Or it was, like, in Diablo 2, it was easy, but it wasn't this easy. In fact, they never even really had a proper tutorial, you just need a hand guide. The mother sleep once more. Oh, there's one. Okay. Uh, new corpse spider. Are there not talent trees anymore? Throw a jar of corpse spiders that attack nearby enemies before dying. Okay. Do I have any choice of anything else I can learn? Just looking for enemies. Kind of want to kill a lot of stuff, get a lot of experience. But we found another cellar. What's going to attack me in here? This chest is empty. Did the creatures take the treasure? That's a good combo there. Oh wow, I can just... I could spin the shit out of that move. You picked up a magical item. Okay. Um. Magic pants. Don't I have to identify it? Guess not. I don't know. A lot of little things are bugging me about the game so far.
Now the sun's getting in my eyes, damn it. It's around the time of day where the sun starts to come in through my side of the house windows. Ah. Spam. Spamming. I hope that move gets nerfed soon. It seems really overpowered for this early in the game. Like, two mana to do that? I hope they get outclassed quickly. How many of these jars do I have? You'd think you'd run out eventually. Waypoint! And I believe I had to go back to hand in a quest. Thank you for your help, but could you talk some sense into Leah? She won't give up on the idea of rescuing her uncle. Nor should she. I will help her find him. Okay. Is that a weeping angel? Come, let us search for your uncle. We'll need to open the cathedral first. The guards locked it up before they were ambushed. Rumford told me they fought their way back to Adria's hut. The key must still be there. Did I just get a party member? I think I did. Weird. So do I have... If I hit O, will it open her inventory? No, it'll say that you have no friends. What an asshole game. Hey, cool, it actually says what time it is in the top right. That's useful. Can I play Resident Evil 4? No, you can't. Fuck that game. You're not allowed. Merchant I've got some brand healer. New goods. Found some interesting things on my latest dig. You should take a look. Okay. That's way too much money for a sash. Increases gold and health pickup by two yards. That is kind of cool. Enjoying the game so far, Mo? Um, kind of. It seems too easy so far, but I guess I am still in the tutorial, but Diablo 1 and 2 never needed a, t a tutorial like this. Uh, it doesn't. also doesn't feel very Diablo, where the music is Diablo-esque, but I don't know. I think I'm going to refrain from buying anything right now. Can't I store gold in here? Okay, I guess not. Can't deposit money anymore, that's weird. Here, let me open the gate. Uh, I want to explore the rest of this part first, though. I can't believe how overpowered that shit is. Ooh. The rumors of torture and worse grow every day. What has happened to Tristram and its king? I once thought Leoric a great man, but it seems I was deceived. We all were. He sends our meager army against Waste March on the morrow. What will become of us? Okay. I'm liking this little bits of backstory for people who haven't played the first games. I have, but it's it's been quite a while since I played the first one, and the second one I haven't played seriously in a long time. So that's nice. Oh. I thought I saw a cannonball. 
searching around the ruins of the city. The old ruins. Is this, is this the ruins of old Tristram? Let me look around a bit. It is! The blacksmith's hut is right here, I think. Right here, I believe, is where the healer might have been. I'm having a little bit of a hard time remembering, but yeah, the cathedral would be up here. Actually, it would be up here, I think. I don't think was this mother, gate wasn't I there, I don't think. Her. She died when I was very young. I was raised by Uncle Deckard. I don't know, maybe I'm remembering it wrong. I'm told he was a great warrior who was lost when Tristram fell to the demons. Okay. Well, there wasn't, like, this big winding path to get to the, uh, cathedral in the, in the first game. So, that must be changed. Unless that place before wasn't, wasn't, uh, what I was thinking it was. Ah, wow, the light getting in my eyes is really annoying. Look! A hidden cellar! Follow me. It's so well hidden that it's glowing. This is a place of power. Your mother hid her secrets here. People said she was a witch, but I never believed. I don't really like my character talking so much. I kind of liked how they just said one or two little lines when you went into certain areas before. Whoa, that was a cool spell. Gotta remember for next time that they explode. That's an annoying place for it to uh, cut off. Okay, Sherpa, la la la. Field. That is health. Oh, that's annoying. I feel like the game's babying me. I don't need, and decent, but again, I can't really seem to use it. Uh, Two-handed weapons cause more damage, but have a slower attack speed. Not all cases, classes can use two-handed weapons. Yeah, but how do I use the fucking bow? Because I'm not able to change these things up. Or I can't switch it to just be a physical attack. So what the hell? Can my class just not use physical attacks? What? If anyone in the chat knows, let me know because the game's not telling me. Here's the key and my mother's journal. What I've seen of it is disturbing. I want to know more about her, but that can wait. We need to save Uncle Deckard first. Okay, I'm her hair Deckard pisses me off. That's not Stay Diablo hair. Study your mother's secrets. That's you like 14 year old scene kid hair Thank before you. she dyes it. Aiden came to me last night. I suspected what was lurking within his troubled heart. I consoled him as best I could. Regardless, wherever he's headed, hell uh, will lighting surely chaos. You can play Fallout's one way. and two. The shadows close in on Tristram once again. But like Aiden, I'll be gone before they fall. Okay. Man, it's a good thing that uh, in old Tristram they invented the talking book. Whoa! Don't worry, I've got OP spider jars. I'll be fine. Well, that was way easier than it should have been. Oops. Hold down shift, hold down left click, and you've won the fight. You know, if that spell just took up more mana, it wouldn't be OP. But it takes up so little mana that I regenerate it before I fully use it. Like, before the next throw. I don't think that should be the case with any attack. Old Tristram Road. Tristram Road. I slurred. Another lost. Another lost. There are a bunch dead here. Can you see the hung people? Uh, 
<sighs> yeah, but here, here's the thing, Snapshot, though. If the throwing spider jars becomes useless later in the game, then why was it here in the first place? That's a balancing issue. Diablo 2 had balancing issues, but it wasn't this shit. The fallen star lies within. There were certain builds you could do in Diablo 2 that would just break the game. If you're a whirly barbarian, and everyone had a whirly barbarian, or if you're a hammerton, then you've won the game. But this shit, like, come on. Oh, wait, hold on, I got a new skill. Now, why aren't I... Strength? Dexterity, Intelligence, Vitality. Why am I not putting those up at each level? Is it automatically doing that? Can I change the settings so it doesn't do that? What? New skill, Defensive. Summon zomb Zombie Dogs. Okay. I still don't have any physical moves. And there are no, like, skill trees. Is everyone one build? Because that would be taking away so much from character building. There's no character building, if that's true. It's just equipment you wear. Here is where the fire fell from the sky. Strange magic comes from below. That looks cool. Can I throw a spider jar in it? Nope, sorry guys. Invisible walls. Yep. If it's anything like his first time playing Skyrim, he'll be done with this in a week or two. No, I still play Skyrim every once in a while. I don't know, I never really get addicted to games. Disease has taken hold in this land, and the carrion bats are near the heart of it. Since returning to Tristram, I have seen their numbers surge. The evil forces that linger here give them strength, and I fear that the worst is yet to come. Later on, you have different upgrades to skills. Okay, that's good that there's at least some, like, differences. My name is Lachdanon, and I am cursed. Once the captain of King Leoric's army, I left only to honor my land and my king. No man has a greater love for his king than I had for mine, even as I drove my blade through his dark and corrupted heart. Okay, nitpicky, but how do I know what Loch Denim's accent is? <laughs> really, really nitpicky. I'll admit that right off the bat, but how do I know his accent? New record, destruction, destroy seven objects. Okay, you're giving me experience for stupid shit now, game. Come on. Okay, these monsters are not terrifying. They don't look like hell spawn like in the first game and the second game. So whenever I see a new enemy, is that what Deckard Kane is telling me about? Because if so, that's cool. The grotesques may seem slow and senseless, but they hide many dangers within their hideously malformed bodies. A set of spikes lurks beneath the monster's flesh, and foul parasites nest within them. It is said that these horrors themselves are constructed by a greater evil, a darkness that I cannot even fathom. I don't know, I have a hard time believing that. You've seen some crazy shit, Kane. I like how you shove their body a little bit and money just, money just flies everywhere. You know, the enemies are getting a little bit tougher so that these jars aren't doing as much damage. But they're still getting distracted with the spiders instead of me, so I can just keep throwing them. I really think that 
there should be a higher mana cost on that spell. Six objects destroyed. Fuck off. I shouldn't be getting bonus experience for that. <laughs> I love how they run. Oops, that was one of my own guys. No wonder I was running at it. Oh, there's a big cooldown on my resummon. Would have been really cool if I noticed that before. Who put 30 gold in this book? It was Lazarus. Of that I am certain. He alone had the king's ear and whispered dark and evil magics into it, instilling the notion of an imminent attack by Westmarch. Afraid to speak against the Archbishop, the councillors nodded their empty heads in agreement and sent us off to die. No. So, my laptop's having a freak out and I can no longer see the chat all of a sudden. Because my laptop is a p massive piece of shit. Yep. Yep. The laptop's being weird. I'm going to force shut down. And I'm going to trust my mods to keep the, uh... Keep the chat civil. Okay, laptop is shut down. For anyone who doesn't know, my laptop, it, I use it as my, uh... I use it to monitor my chat. Now I'm going to turn the laptop back on. It better goddamn work. Whoa! It's an old broken down laptop. Aha! Uh -huh. Man, there's nothing strong under it. That felt pointless. It forced shut itself down again. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to see the chat for a while, guys, just so you know. Uh, because I believe it's overheated again. Because you know it's tendency to overheat because it has a broken fan. So I'm just gonna give it a while to cool off. My room is very, very hot right now. But I'll take care of that soon. I'm going on five minute break in about. 10-15 minutes anyways. We have an empty equipment set. Okay. I feel very Diablo so far, just bugging me.
Oh, that one moves fast. Oh, there are a few of them. I'm just gonna wait till my summons come back to back me up. And I might as well just kite them in circles. And I just need to throw jars through the doorway. That was easy. Okay, I'm gonna try booting up the laptop again. Wish it luck, guys. from our horrific defeat in Westmarch, my beloved king lost all pretense of sanity. He seethed with rage, spitting curses upon us as traitors. With great sorrow, And the laptop overheated again. That or it just died. It wouldn't surprise me at all if the laptop's dead now. Uh, it was on, it's been on its last legs for a while. Hope it's not dead though, or else I have no way to monitor the chat during this game. Unless I change the resolution around a bit. If I can't get this thing working, I'll do that on the break. Man, everything takes up like no inventory space. Wait, is there anything else I'm supposed to do here? Oh, go to the right. They're such loyal henchmen that um, they immediately ignore Decker Kane and go after me. I like to think he said that to me. Zombie dogs? You wanna like do what you're supposed to do and defend me? <sighs> Unidentified sword. Mm. Okay, so there's a wrist slot now. Oh, thank you, but why did you risk yourself for me? Because you needed my help. Come, I must return you to Leah. Oh, it is wonderful to hear that Leah is well. I fear the worst. I learned of this secret passage through old maps I found. Okay. Convenient. 
We must discuss the fallen star. Follow me to Tristram. Okay. I have kept my word to Leah and rescued her uncle Cain. I pulled him from the clutches of the Skeleton King, who still holds the fallen star. I gotta go sell crap. I've dug up. I worked my hands to the bone to bring you these fine goods. Uncle, you're alive! Let me try the laptop Thanks again. To you. Actually, no, it feels really hot here. still. I seek your wisdom. Tell me of the fallen star. The prophecy of the end days surely points to it as a sign that the end has begun. Please, Uncle. Not more of your stories. All that matters now is that you're back. My power grows vast. Yeah, I'm really not liking how my character keeps talking back and forth with people. It does not feel Diablo. Alright, any new skills? Fire bats. No. I do not have enough mana. So I can hold it and it's like a flamethrower. A ridiculous looking flamethrower. Um I don't know. It it seems okay, but it blows through mana fast and it's not quite as useful. Or at least it look, doesn't look like it'd be quite as useful as just slowing down enemies while I lob spiders at them. I'll try it out a little bit. Actually, let me boot the laptop one last time. See if it can make it to the, uh, the desktop. The skeleton king was once our beloved lord, Leoric. He was driven mad by Diablo's evil. He lost both of his sons and his very soul before he was finally defeated. Now it seems he's risen to plague this land once again. Leoric should be in the unformed land. Yet, he stands between me and the Fallen Star. The key to defeating him lies in his old crown. Seek out our blacksmith, Hadrig. He knows of its whereabouts. Okay. Leah, you should not dismiss the sign so lightly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the laptop the is pretty much dead now. It's acting really Horrors weird. Have visited Tristram before, and it endured. But what of the texts? The Zakarum tomes warn of a falling star. The Herodric scroll spoke of the dead rising and the Lord of Lies. The prophecy of the end days. Oh no! Says no, it's a desktop. Things, Assuming it doesn't overheat while there. Shall appear in the heavens. Yes, you've been telling me about the texts since I was eight years old, Uncle. I just don't think we should read too much into them. Okay. So the next quest is over here. Yes, yes. Each of my items is very special to me, but I suppose I can sell you one or two things if I must. You're weird. Leah spent all night alongside the blacksmith's wife, tending the wounded. What? She was out defending the gates this morning. What is driving that woman? Did you hear? Old Rumford has us down to half rations. How are we supposed to fight if we're starving? The rest of the town is down to quarter, including my wife. But you can quit if you want. Blacksmith, Deckard Cain said you could help me find the crown of Neoric. Not now. It's my wife. She's locked in the cellar like Jesus. all those who've been bitten. I'm to put them all down. But how can I kill my own wife? It must be done, Blacksmith. I will help you. Thank you. Follow me. Wow, this is a depressing quest. Doesn't feel particularly Diablo either. Diablo was dark, but not in this way. We never had to worry about people's personal issues. We kind of had better things to do. You know? Okay, 
let's try it. I'm sorry. You suffer, blacksmith. Aid us. Need more mana. It's strong, but it blows through mana fast. Wow, I regenerate mana quickly. My love, forgive me. Fine, I'm just gonna whip spiders at you then. I couldn't have done this without you. I'm in your debt. My name is Hedrig Eamon. I need your assistance, Hedrig. I search for the crown of York. I can help you there. It's buried with his chancellor, my grandfather. You'll find his tomb in a cemetery in the Weeping Hollow. Okay. And if you see my fool apprentice out there, tell him to get back to town. You know, the first and second game didn't need this much dialogue. Like, this much inane dialogue and mini-quests just to get you on the right track for your next quest. It was mostly dungeon crawling. What's this crap? I can tell you what this crap is, not dungeon crawling. <sighs> okay, I think the laptop's good enough for me to boot up the uh, uh, Google Chrome. Hope it doesn't overheat while doing that, because if it tries to load the stream, it'll overheat without a doubt. There's a big pack coming this time. Stand your ground. Oh. That's the last of them. The bridge is clear. You guys were afraid of that? I think it would have been funny if I burnt down the whole bridge by accident doing that. And we couldn't progress with the rest of the game. Um, this bat thing, it's, it's, it's kind of useful, easy. but I kind of like just slowing them down. It's safer, you know? Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to switch up skill. Need more time. Next. There we go. I also feel like I can't easily tell what's going on in some of these fights. Whoa. What level am I? Level 5, okay. Okay, open up Twitch TV. Wish for the best, guys. I should have. Whoa, what the hell happened there? Hold on, let me pause the video in the stream. That worked good. There we go. Now I'm not distracted. Let me get back to this fight. Well, it keeps making me pop up. Okay, guys, you, I, I can see the chat now. I can't see anything that you said before, but I can see now. Uh, well, this will kill some time before my final. That's the first thing I've been able to see since the laptop uh, started working again.
I haven't had to use a single healing potion yet. This game is... It's pissing me off how easy it is so far. Like, I know I'm still in the beginning, but Jesus. The game's really baby. That's special. I'd rather have the, in the intellect. Ooh, rare spawn. Thanks for the knockback. I didn't want to be in that fight anyways. I heard some Koreans live stream this themselves and beat in two hours. Uh, probably South Koreans, I'd assume. And that wouldn't be that wouldn't be overly surprising. I can buy it. I'm missing my uh I'm really missing the uh what's it called bar? The uh potion belt. I still can't get over how overpowered these spider jars are. I wish it would stop giving me little bonuses for like just playing the game. This apprentice's spirit dwells within the unformed land now. Hate demon should be killed. Yeah, I'm not enjoying this game so far. I don't know why everyone like I'm I'm seeing all these messages online, but it's like best game ever! And it's like I think they're just saying that out of nostalgia. But even then, I love Diablo 1 and 2. This is not nearly as good as Diablo 1 or 2 so far. Diablo 1 and 2 were really good from the start. This is not really good from the start. If it gets better, then it gets better and I'll be happy about that. But... The start of this game is not good. Apparently everything Blizzard touches turns to gold. That's because Blizzard mostly makes really good games. But uh, that's not to say they don't miss sometimes. thing down here. Oh, that just says what effect I have on me. How long it lasts. Okay. Light and Shrine. I'll do that after mine wears off. I can't get over how overpowered these stupid spiders are. It's like the stone golem all over again. I feel like a, a dark dwarf. This is starting to feel a little Diablo in this part, where I'm going through the open fields and stuff at the same time. What's with the border of the map? It's not the usual, like, squared off areas. Doesn't feel Diablo. Yeah, tell me about it. Like, fucking everything I'm fighting is a zombie. In Bloodmore, there were like four different enemy types. That was the very first field in Diablo 2. 
All I'm fighting are goddamn zombies, and they don't even look like Diablo zombies. Oh, what's this? No, no, zombies. Just zombies, guys. Sorry, I thought something interesting was happening. Apparently we haven't fought enough zombies yet. Just gonna throw spiders at it. Spiders and zombies, guys. We're good. So what's the story of the Diablo games, anyways? Uh, in Ultra Ultra Brief, the story of the Diablo games is um, the a, a higher angel thing. I forget his name. Starts with A and Dariel, something like that. No, and Dariel's a lesser demon. Whatever. Uh, there is an archangel who imprisoned uh, Diablo, Bale, and one of the other greater evils in a soul stone inside a cathedral in Tristram. A uh, long time later, the Chancellor of the, of the King of Tristram uh, freed the demons from the Soul Stone, and the demons took over the king, who left, who ran an extremely corrupt and horrible uh, crusade, I believe, against a whole bunch of other people. And it spread evil throughout the entire world, and you're trying to clean up the evil. That's that's the story of the Diablo games in extreme brief. Their pathfinding kind of freaks out and they get stuck by my spiders. Another reason these spiders are overpowered is enemies will get distracted fighting them instead of me. Just gotta keep backing up and throwing spiders. Eh. I'm gonna go ahead and say, this game's not nearly as fun as Diablo 2 so far. I had way more fun yesterday with Diablo 2. Now look, we're in a graveyard now. Are we going to fight maybe some zombies? Yeah, look out, more zombies, guys. Great yard. Zombie spider fight. Oh, there's a card. But I'm not a paladin. In fact, paladins aren't in this game. I don't know why they took them out. I think I'm gonna switch up the spells. There. Variety! Needs more time. Oh, it takes a while to switch, I guess. What happened? The beta of the game looked good from what I saw. What the fuck happened between the beta and now? Why do I even have a mail or a range weapon? Why do I even have a bow? I can't use it. I haven't been able to use any kind of weapon since level 1. I've just been throwing goddamn jars. My mana regenerates so fast. The waypoints don't look right. Every little thing is pissing me off about this game so far. People were like uploading this, and they're like, oh my god, this is so fun, it's so Diablo. They captured the, the essence of Diablo with this game. No, they didn't. What the hell is this? Do you have any arrows to use the bow? Well, it doesn't matter if I have any arrows or not, although I don't see an arrow slot, so I'm guessing I just have infinite. They got rid of my, my slot that was a, my weapon at level 2, and there's no way to get it back. The tutorials haven't told me anyway. I've tried to look through every little thing, 
I'm not seeing any kind of way. What the hell? Where I can't edit my taskbar. All I can do is cycle between what spells I want on what mouse button. But for instance, left mouse button can only be these spells, and right mouse button can only be these spells. Oh, what's this? Shoot multiple poison darts at the same enemy. Okay, well I'll try that out and see if it's any good. Needs more time. What the fuck was I just shooting my bow? Nope, nope, it just stopped letting me do it. Drag the weapon into the slot. Let me try that. Can't. Nope. That would make too much sense. Sorry. It only lets me use the bow if another skill's recharging. Need more time. Maybe. Not really. What the fuck is going on? I don't know how they fucked up this bad. It's pissing me off. The skill runes are the are the upgrades you were talking about earlier. So there is no customization. I'm just given these things. Okay, never mind. I take back what how I was saying how the game might improve. What the hell? Okay, these don't seem to be any more useful than they were before. Splinters, except... Not ready yet. And you see, when, when the spell is still getting ready, I can use my bow, but I can't after. There we go. Now this is more useful. But still, no customization. What the hell? What... One of, if not the greatest part of Diablo 2 was making your build. It's one of the most important, without a doubt. Everyone had a different build. Everyone was unique, even though there were only like six or seven classes. Yeah, I agree. It is weird and stupid. Yeah, they did take a shit on Diablo. What the hell is this? I'm gonna switch to Grasp of the Dead since I already have enough DPS. I'm never running out of mana with this move. Needs more time. Like none of my moves actually use up mana fast enough for me to uh, use it up before I regenerate. So I can just use this infinitely. What's even the point of this taking up mana? Because I regenerate it before I use it. Swarms and swarms of enemies with no effort whatsoever. This is just a grind. Wow, this is disappointing. Why isn't it telling me to help the enemies anymore? Oh, now it is. Sometimes it just doesn't feel like it, you know? The spirits smile upon me. Man, I really feel like accomplished something getting that level. Not. Increase the amount of enemies that are slowed. Okay, well, this is the spell I'm using anyways, so it's nice. So you're just, you're just handed what your next spells and skills are. You don't actually pick anything. What the fuck? But they'll patch it. I, okay, I, I'm not gonna say... But they'll patch it and make it better, because the, if day one, the game is like this, I don't know if they're going to take a new direction and actually fix it up. If Even if they are, how can they fuck up this bad initially? Like, I remember StarCraft when it first came out, 
It needed to be patched a lot, but it wasn't fucked up this badly. Diablo 2 when it first came out. It's not that bad. Okay, that was a joke? Good. <laughs> I can't think of any Blizzard game that was this bad on release. Okay, well, World of Warcraft was unstable as fuck on release, but it was still fun. Ah, uh, what is this crap? What is this crap? Demons have been known to devour their own young when no other nourishment is available. Their offspring, the imps, sometimes manage to flee and band together with other demon spawn. They rove in vicious packs, ready to descend upon the unwary traveler and rip his body to shreds with their tiny needle-sharp teeth. If they need to patch it, they sold you an unfinished game. I agree. Almost as bullshit as on-disc DLC. The only difference is patching is usually free. This game is thoroughly pissing me off right now. I'm gonna call for five minute break, guys. Uh, I need to get some more water, and I'm going to have this part start uploading to YouTube. So the people over on the channel don't miss the stream. That way, at least they can see it in retrospect. So, I'll be back in five minutes, guys. See you then.